Message coming in. Patching it through. I have a difficult assignment, Commander. You're the only one I can trust to get it done. There's a criminal leader named Darius in the Skillian Verge who controls most of the raider activity. I'd like you to negotiate a ceasefire with him. You're kidding. Admiral, I'm the last person who should be negotiating a ceasefire. That's exactly why I chose you, Commander. Darius is a warrior. He wouldn't take an Alliance negotiator seriously. But with your very public achievements, you represent a strong image that Darius has to respect. Show him that the Alliance won't back down. Show him he better make peace while he can. I still think this is a mistake, Admiral. You're not under my command, but we need you for this job. You're the only one that could get it done right. The meeting will take place on a remote barren planet. I'm transmitting the coordinates now. I'm also transmitting the background for this negotiation. Fifth Fleet out. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Ten hut! At ease. Rear Admiral Mihailovic, Fifth Fleet. Admiral, I'm on urgent business with the Citadel. Is there something you need? Let's get one thing clear, Shepard. You might be a specter to the aliens, but to me, you're just another junior officer. Be respectful. I command the 63rd Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. And the Council got their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. I wasn't keen on it either, but there are advantages to being above the law. Don't let the title go to your head. No one's above the law. I don't begrudge the politician's decision to throw you to the council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. This ship saved our lives a dozen times over. An exaggeration. I've read your reports. This experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills. For the same price, we could have had a heavy cruiser. But no. We had to make nice to the Turians, throw money at a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. Normandy is an Alliance warship, but she's on loan to the Citadel. That means she's not in your chain of command. I believe there's something wrong with my ears. Did you just contradict me? This ship is Council property right now. So, respectfully, please clear the gangway. Have it your way, Commander but expect me to file a report on this. Exogeny officials have announced that their research colony on Pharos is being shut down. Difficult living conditions combined with poor yield of viable discoveries made it economically unfeasible to keep the colony going. Exogeny stock rose sharply with the announcement, with investors pleased at this surprising news.
Kalisa bin seen in Al Jalani, Westernland News. Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? What sort of questions? People back home have heard a lot of wild stories about you, Commander. I can give you the chance to set the record straight. What do you say? So long as you understand that I may not be able to answer all questions. I'm sure our viewers will understand. Humans have been trying to get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. With that in mind, what are your feelings on being the first human specter? We all know it should have happened years ago. I hope the Council realizes that we won't sit at the kids' table forever. Some believe that without firm action on our part, the Council will continue to treat us like poor relations. Have you encountered any situations where the Citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? I think they know not to ask me to work against my own people. I think our viewers will be glad to hear that, Commander. You've been given command of an advanced human warship for your missions. Is there anything you'd like to say about it? The Normandy is a triumph of human engineering. Like our development of fighter carriers, it shows other races that we're able to think outside the box. That's gratifying. Many defeatist officers claim that the Alliance can't compete with the naval power of, say, the Turians. Do you think it was appropriate to hand Earth's most advanced warship over to the Citadel? Miss Algelani, I wear the Alliance uniform. And if you think anyone other than me says where the Normandy can go, you're sadly mistaken. No offense intended, Commander. I'm sure you have to follow the orders of your superiors. Of course, now your superiors are aliens. Speaking of your new job, did the Council order you to sabotage human research concern on Novaria? I made that call to save myself, my crew, and the inhabitants of Novaria. And I'd do it again. It's gratifying to see someone who'll make tough choices to protect the lives of humans. Given your recent experiences, do you think humanity will ever get the respect it deserves from the galactic community? Ever read Machiavelli? He believed it's better to be feared than loved. If we build a few dozen more dreadnoughts, I guarantee we'll be respected. I hope they remember that when they pass the next defense budget. One last question, Commander. Rumors back home say you're tracking a rogue specter named Saren. Do you have any comment on that? I've had enough of your snide insinuations. You son of a bitch! I'll make sure everyone in the Alliance sees that. Your career is over. Hello, Commander. Show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you.
Alliance officials report that a Geth incursion into the Armstrong cluster has been repulsed, with the Geth suffering heavy casualties. In the event of future Geth activity, the Alliance plans to maintain a strong security presence in the area. Shepard, what can I do for you now? I'll be going now. Goodbye. Commander Shepard, I am Nasana Dantius. I'm glad you're here. I must talk to you about my sister Dahlia. She's been kidnapped by slavers. I killed Dahlia myself, and I know she was blackmailing you. Hmm. And I was all set to try to manipulate you into hunting her down for me. But I guess that won't be necessary now, will it? You wanted your sister dead? If people found out my sister was a criminal, I'd be considered a security risk. They'd revoke my clearance, or place me on administrative leave until she was apprehended. I shall transfer a little something into your account as a token of my appreciation. I'm sure you'll find the amount satisfactory. I'm a specter, not some merc for hire. I can find credits anywhere. True, but I'm the only one who can authorize you to purchase prototype Asari mods. I will get you added to our manufacturer's preferred client list. I think you'd be very interested in what they have available. Goodbye, Shepard. It has been a pleasure doing business with you. I gave you what you wanted, Shepard. We have nothing more to discuss. Your Honoveria report raised a few eyebrows in the Council, Shepard. I don't know what's funnier, you finding a species they thought they'd wiped out 2,000 years ago, or their reaction when they found out you finished them off. The Rachni were monsters. I couldn't let them live. I agree with you. I don't want giant telepathic insects running around in my galaxy. But you could have been more discreet. The Council keeps throwing around words like genocide. I have to go calm them down. Yes, Commander? Where can I find Admiral Kohoku? Last I heard. Is there anything else, Commander? Do you know anything about Vermeer? Sorry, Shepard. I've never even heard of it before all this. You'll have to go out there and check it out for yourself. I want to know the truth about you and Saren. I want to know about the mission you were on together all those years ago. We had intel on a rogue scientist being funded by Batarian interests. He was trying to set up a facility to develop illegal AI technology out in the Verge. 
Alliance Intel had done all the work, but the Council wanted a Spectre involved. We compromised. I was assigned to help Saren in his investigation. We tracked the scientist to a refining facility on Kamala. He was hidden away somewhere inside, protected by an army of Batarian mercenaries. The plan was simple. Sneak into the plant, capture the scientist, sneak back out. Quick, quiet, and a minimum of bloodshed. I'm guessing things didn't go as planned. Officially, it was ruled an accident, but I think Saren detonated- Sounds like overkill to me. There, there was- Saren didn't care. The only thing I care about is stopping You're Saren. right, Commander. I should go. I'll be here if you need me. So, Williams, are you happy you signed on with Commander Shepard? I'm not sure, Lieutenant. Every time I think I have a handle on things, the universe banks hard to port. Well, don't let anybody know. A big gun and a confident attitude will get you through a lot in life. appreciate what you're doing for me. Please let me know as soon as you find any information on my brother. Command Hello again, Commander. I've got a proposition for you. Since you helped me get information on the crime syndicate, I've gotten a lot more backing from my publishers. I'm investigating traffic controller conditions now, and I wondered if you could help. What do you want me to do? I've heard rumors that the space traffic controllers are overworked to a dangerous degree. I can't get into the control room, but you could. If you planted a bug inside, I could crack the story. If you crack this story, what's likely to happen? Ideally, there will be calls to improve working conditions by hiring more controllers and upgrading systems. The Council won't pay for improvements voluntarily. This story will provide that pressure. What will this bug allow you to pick up? Just audio and video. I'm not trying to tap into the traffic control system if that's what you're worried about. I just need to hear and see them in order to correlate their activity with traffic efficiency. Everyone knows space traffic controllers are overworked. How is this news? There's a difference between overworked and dangerous. Traffic at the Citadel has increased by 300% in the last century, but traffic controller resources haven't kept up. We already have several last-minute wave-offs per week. <laughs> Do we have to wait for a full-blown disaster? This bug you want me to play, could it interfere with traffic signals? Absolutely not. I made certain that the frequencies it uses won't interfere with anything. 
I can't promise anything, but I'll see what I can do. Give me the bug. Excellent. Just place it on a terminal with a good view of the area. Thanks again for your help. In the long run, this story is going to save lives. No, I'm waiting. Commander, any word on my missing men? I found them. What was left of them. They ran into a thresher maw. A thresher maw? That's not... My men wouldn't just stumble into a thresher nest. Not the entire unit. Somebody lured them there with an Alliance distress beacon. Placed it perfectly so they'd land right beside the thresher nest. Damn it. I had a bad feeling about this ever since my team disappeared. An Alliance beacon used as bait. My unit wiped out. And nobody seems to know anything about it. Commander, I appreciate what you did. Now I need to do my part. The families of those Marines deserve to know why they died. Captain Anderson said you had information on Baines. Not as much as I'd like to. One of my crews found him, frozen stiff on board. The missing recon group? Anything you need from me? Not right now, Shepard, but I'll let you know as soon as I find something out.
Hello again. Is there a problem? I'm not detecting any signals from the bug yet. I planted the bug. If you aren't getting a signal, they must have found it. But I never got a signal. They couldn't have found it that quickly. Are you calling me a liar? No. No, of course not. Here, this is what I was going to pay you. Thanks for trying anyway. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should go talk to my publishers about finding another story. They told me it was you, but I didn't believe it. Shepard grew up and turned into a soldier. An impatient soldier. Who are you and why are you in my way? Name's Finch. You probably don't remember me, but we ran together in the 10th Street Reds. Maybe you don't remember it yourself, running in a gang. None of the vids mention it when they're talking about you. The vids never tell the whole story. So, what can I do for the Reds? One of the Reds, Kurt Wiseman, got picked up by Turians. We'd like you to talk to the Turian guard in the bar and get Kurt out. What was this guy arrested for? Some stupid minor offense. Maybe he had a little red sand. You know how the Turians are. They declared him a problem, and they're shipping him back for a trial. You're not asking me to break Wiseman out of jail, are you? Of course not. But word has it, you've got some pull with the aliens. All we're asking you to do is pull a little for us. What was one of the 10th Street Reds doing in Turian space? Since your days, the Reds have expanded. We do some salvage, a little shipping here and there, that kind of thing. I'll talk to the Turian and see what I can do. Thanks, Shepard. I knew you'd remember your old friends. The guard's over in Korra's den. Take care of this, and you'll never see me again. got a prisoner named Kurt Wiseman. I'd like that prisoner freed. I'd like a lot of things, human. Desire forms the foundations of organized society. That said, the xenophobe will remain in Turian custody. This is not negotiable. What sentence is Wiseman likely to receive? Considering that he attempted to commit a xenophobic hate crime, I would expect him to receive a lifetime imprisonment. Why are you calling him a xenophobe? The human acknowledged his affiliation with several anti-alien organizations. His crime specifically targeted Turians as a species. It was a hate crime and will be treated as such at his sentencing. What crime did Wiseman commit? He attempted to poison medical cargo being sent to a Turian colony to treat an outbreak of a dangerous disease. If he'd succeeded, millions would have died. This human is a dangerous xenophobe. I'd rather not have to kill all your guards to free this man. Why do you want this criminal released? Is it part of your mission, or are you just helping another human? 
I'm a specter. I don't answer to you. Release Wiseman, now. The Council should have known the humans were not ready for the authority of the specters. The prisoner will be released. Turian people at least respect the rule of law. statement. It showed that I bought something from you, then I bought it. Well, thank you for buying from me, but this still doesn't prove that you purchased that item from my store. But I didn't buy anything else here. How do I know that? If you don't have the proof of purchase, I can't help you. But... Sorry. You were too busy to talk last time, but that's not a problem. I know you're busy being the first human specter and all. There's a lot going on right now. Is there something I can do for you? This will be fast. I just wanted you to know what a big fan I am, and I was wondering if I could get a picture. Sure, no problem. Just hold up your gun. Perfect. Thanks again, Commander. I'm gonna hang this in my living room. My wife will love it. Yes, human. You need something, yes? What do you know about Baines? I have never met him, human. Goodbye. Yes, all right then. Good tidings to you, human.
again for all your power. I'm waiting for someone else. Hey there, welcome to Flux. Yes, Commander. Is there something I can do for you? You're a doctor. I chose to keep the medical... Let me take a look at what you have for sale. Of course. I've never been a real fan of crowds. Alliance officials have raided a dangerous cult controlled by a former Alliance officer, Major Kyle. Major Kyle and his cultists refused to surrender and were killed in the resulting firefight. Those Asari commandos are impressive. 
Lightly armored, but their speed more than makes up for it. Unless that speed lets them outrun bullets, I'm more inclined to stick with nice, solid armor. And a big gun. Point taken. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Decontamination in progress. Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. <laughs> 